This is the National Weather Service office here in Gaylord, Michigan, with your morning hazardous weather briefing for Friday, May 10th of 2013. We do have a couple of things to be concerned with over the next several days. First of all, we've been talking about a frost and freeze possibility, which is looking more and more likely for early Monday morning in northern lower Michigan. And any sensitive plants could receive some possible damage with those cold temperatures. And also, thunderstorms are going to be possible for the upcoming work week on Wednesday and Thursday across northern Michigan. The details on these thunderstorms are to be determined as the expectations for these thunderstorms are well out to the future, so those sort of details come as the time draws closer. So taking a look at the current weather map, we do have some widespread steady light rains that are moving in over the entire area as low pressure moves from northern Illinois toward far southern lower Michigan. There's also another area of low pressure that we see in south-central Canada. And as this one area of low pressure producing the light rains moves off to the east as we go into late this afternoon and this evening, that next area of low pressure will gradually move in towards the northern Great Lakes, shoving another cold front towards us. And that cold front will also push well to the east as we go by Sunday morning there. and We're going to be firmly in place with some cold northerly winds that are pretty gusty blowing in from Canada. Then we see high pressure settling into the central part of the country, which will eventually move in over the Great Lakes region Monday morning. And with the lighter winds and clearing skies, we are expecting this particular time for our frost and freezing temperatures to occur. Now we do see upstream across the Dakotas and up into south-central Canada. There's a warm front. We'll start to see temperatures moderate with time as we see the warm front pushes into the Great Lakes region Tuesday. And then by Wednesday... We do have that chance of thunderstorms with the warm front and also the cold front coming through as we move into Thursday. So that wraps up the weather map for the next several days. As far as the headlines, well, much colder through the weekend with the more seasonable weather to return in the work week. As far as today, we're going to feel those much cooler temperatures out there with high temperatures in the upper 40s, actually middle 40s, to maybe the lower to middle 50s for parts of eastern upper where they're going to see some sunshine this afternoon. All other areas are going to see rain ending from west to east. It may take until early afternoon for northeast lower. And then to wrap up the hazards over these next several days, first of all, those thunderstorm possibilities for next Wednesday and Thursday and the frost freeze conditions for the cold temperatures expected early Monday morning. And that does it for this hazardous weather briefing. Please come back for our next scheduled broadcast at around 5 o'clock this afternoon. Thank you for listening to your National Weather Service here in Gaylord, Michigan.